Hello guys and welcome to the episode of Rust Building Guide. Today we are dealing with a newly designed bunker base for duo and trio teams. Mainly Let's get right into the preview of the base. So first of all, we have a airlock here with a drop box and a vending machine if you want to sell something. Of course, you can replace this with a wall, just wall or a shop front, whatever you like. Then we have a little airlocks here and then it, it goes up and uh, then, then we go down. And this is the bunker section of the base. It only works when you are uh, leaving the server, but when you when you're joining, uh, you uh, place this here and keep it here until you leave. Do not upgrade this, okay? Yeah, let's move on. Now we come up to the third floor of the base. Here we have two garage doors. We pretty much, let's open all the doors here, this section. Here we have a locker box and uh, two beds. Now for two beds, you can replace the locker box for beds and also place uh, uh, bags here, if you like, whatever you like. Here we have a elevator going uh, third, fourth and fifth floor total. Uh, you can also replace this section with uh, hatches or whatever you like, but uh, I prefer elevators. We, we like them. My teammates prefer them. So of course we, we need them in the base and it's cool feature. No one uses them. And with hatch, we go to the second floor and here we have a loot room number, number two. So it's uh, eight boxes total. Easy, easily accessible and some furnaces over here. Then we go one down and to the first floor. Here we have tool cupboard, we're very secured here and a one loot room here, two boxes. It's next to the uh, bunker design, just two boxes. It's a very nice design. And here we have a loot room number one. Uh, so we have lots of loot room. Total is is it uh, t t 14 boxes? Yeah, I think so. If my math, math right. But th these are the uh, loading sections. It's I think it's pretty much very, very secure. And also this table. I don't have a electricity on. So I will go up the stairs like this. So, the fourth floor, we have a shooting floor. You can uh, shoot from here. You can place whatever you like here. You can replace and put the bags here, however you like. And 10th, uh, last floor, uh, fifth floor over here. We have uh, the roof. You can place sentries here if you like. Uh, and also the windmill and here is a very very nice roof camping area let's take a look on how you lock the base with the bunker design so let's get uh, on the bunker entrance here and when you leave the server you destroy this piece right here i think you have to shoot it at that point and then you have to uh, put a frame on the downer level it's not easy, so you put uh, one right here and it's uh, easier to put on the lower level. And remove this upper, then place a roof here and upgrade it. And that's pretty much it. It will uh, look like this from the Raiders perspective. He booms this, now he's stuck here and you, you can't uh, destroy that wig from here, not possible. So you have to destroy this whole thing. Yeah. And when you come on, 
online next time, you just uh, come here and uh, destroy this twig. And yeah, that's pretty much the base, all of it. And feel free to comment on how would you improve the base and uh, do you like the design? Anyways, let's get uh, on the building. Okay, let's start building. Let's start uh, with the starter, starter base. So first we built two by one, add four triangles to it and another two by one right here. Actually, this one uh, on the punker side is uh, upper foundation and then one uh, triangle here. So it should look like this pretty much. And uh, for the starter, I like to upgrade it to stone for first. You might not have some other materials that much. You basically do it like this. On the upper foundation, you add a half walls and all the others are um, normal walls, normal sized. And you upgrade them to stone, right like this. And uh, build these, nice. Actually, <laughs> actually you don't, you don't do this. And they add a tool copper right here. And if you like, you can, uh, already upgrade the uh, tool copper to metal if if you have materials ready. Then you add the roof. Every section except this one. This is for the hatch. And for the entrance you add a uh, middle middle level uh, floor for the bunker, so it comes right here. Nice, yeah. So this is the starter section. You can enter it uh, with li like this for the start, or however you like, basically. You can just just build a. Uh, do door for here, like this, and put a double door right here. And there you have the starter, pretty much. It doesn't require much resources, and all, yeah, ladder here. Nice. <laughs> Okay, now you have the starter ready. You have maybe gathered some materials, uh, guns, etc. And uh, also metal. You can upgrade this uh, inner section with a metal, full metal. I, I prefer this at this point. So this first floor, I upgrade straight to metal pretty much every time, but you can do it with your own recommendations. Yeah, we start with this and a, then we add a ramp here. I actually upgrade it too. And uh, remember to add the boxes here. And also you have to lock them before uh, placing the okay, it it was only one. You have to lock them before placing the uh, lower wall here because you you can't access them at least not in this editing mode. So I prefer locking them up and like this, it's checkered. But yeah, let's get on the second stage of building. Uh, now we built the honeycombing of the base. So basically it's it's simple. We just added triangles uh, to the uh, two by ones like this. And then um, 
normal foundations like this and fill in the gaps with triangles for the last okay we're missing one here yeah okay it's happening now this pretty much the foundation design we are looking for and from this on it's uh, pretty easy to build at least the honeycombing you just uh, build you know everyone knows honeycombing I don't, I'm showing it in this video, I just show the core. You can fill in the outside yourself. But yeah, from now on, we can build uh, this layer here. And for this section, you can either build a, a doorway for vending machine, or if you prefer shop front you can build the frame for it like this but uh, I prefer vending machine because I, I like to sell sell things and uh, f with now with the copter thing it's pretty much secure you can also add a sheet metal door if you don't cut vending machine yet and for the hatches hatches sections uh, like this one you can just add the ladders for now if you don't have blueprints yet and for this you don't even need one great and for here I can just upgrade this to metal straight away So let's upgrade the inner part straight to metal on the second floor right like oh my god I, I hate this uh, this bug I don't know is it on, only on the building servers but it's so annoying or only on the model servers I, I usually play on 2x only so I don't really know what's up on the OG Rust but yeah so we at hatch here so the hatch goes straight into the third floor and you enter the base from there right like this and you can add if you have a hatch on this point just add hatch here like this and upgrade this also to metal straight like this This, this we have, have a hatch here and fill in this hole add a loot room here ramp half for half floor here let's upgrade this and add ramp on top and then add boxes here and fill it up same same here like this and add a second loot room here with these ramps like this and second floor is pretty much done just add a hatch here if you have materials for it otherwise you can just add a door like this for here for example if you don't have hatch, do this. Add double doors here or something and re replace them with garage doors when you have materials ready. Yeah, pretty simple. Now add a hull floor here. Uh, upgrade it. Add a floor here. Upgrade, upgrade. This is just honeycombing for now and here nice also add a wall right here if you like you can make this a uh, looting room also like this if you like I, I don't like the idea so i don't use it i don't gather that much uh, loot 
in the wipe, so it doesn't really matter for me. But yeah, this is pretty much the build here. Like this, upgrade the stone. And the inner walls, I always like to upgrade straight to metal. But now, you have secure base here for the stage 2. And you can entrance it from here. You have to look down uh, to, to place this access floor, access roof. And now you have a second floor ready to use. And now on, the third floor goes pretty much like, like all the others. Like this. And the outer walls stone. Yeah. And now this section will be for the elevator or however you like to build it. If you prefer hatches, if you prefer uh, half floor entrances, it's up to you basically. There is a million choices to make. And with this, just add this and you are good to go. Then you can transfer your uh, pets to here. Just remember to build the roof also. And if you got pets already on this point, add them here. Like this. And yeah. These um, three floors are, are the crucial part of the build. The shooting floor and the uh, roof are up to you, basically. There. But yeah, thanks, thanks for watching. Uh,